Antarctica, the coldest, most isolated continent on Earth. A place where few dare to venture and even fewer survive. But one man's tale of endurance here stands out among all others. The story of Douglas Mawson. Who was this man who dared to challenge the Antarctic's wrath? Born in 1882, Douglas Mawson was a geologist and explorer whose name would become synonymous with Antarctic exploration. An indomitable spirit driven by scientific curiosity and a love for adventure. Mawson's journey began far from the frozen wastelands of the South. Raised in the sun-baked landscapes of Australia, his fascination with the natural world was evident from a young age. His passion for geology led him to pursue a path that few had dared to walk. In 1911, Mawson embarked on what would become his most famous expedition. The Australasian Antarctic Expedition aimed to explore the uncharted territories of the Antarctic, a mission filled with the promise of discovery and the peril of the unknown. The preparation for this journey was immense. Selecting a team of men as hardy and determined as himself, Mawson meticulously planned every detail. They would need enough supplies to withstand the harsh Antarctic conditions for over a year. As they set sail, the enormity of their undertaking became clear. The Southern Ocean was a treacherous beast, its icy waters and violent storms a foreboding welcome to the world's most inhospitable continent. Upon their arrival, Antarctica's vast, desolate beauty struck them, a landscape of endless ice and snow where the sun barely rose above the horizon and temperatures plunged far below freezing. The challenges began immediately, establishing a base camp, battling constant blizzards and enduring extreme cold. However, this was merely the start of Mawson's journey. Douglas Mawson, along with his fellow explorers Belgrave Ninnis and Xavier Mertz, leaving their ship and crew behind, set out on a courageous expedition to discover the secrets of the immense Arctic wilderness, resolute in their mission to unravel the enigmas of this frozen realm. The team pushed forward, driven by Mawson's unwavering leadership. They collected geological samples, mapped uncharted territories, and studied the unique wildlife. But the true test of their mettle was yet to come. As they delved deeper into the heart of Antarctica, the team faced relentless adversity. The blizzards were like nothing they had ever experienced, and the terrain was treacherous, filled with hidden crevasses waiting to claim the unwary. Then, tragedy struck. A crevasse, hidden beneath a deceptive snow layer, took one of their own. Lieutenant Belgrave Ninnis, along with crucial supplies, was lost to the icy depths. The expedition, already a battle for survival, now faced an existential crisis. Antarctica was relentless in its ferocity. Temperatures dropped sharply, winds screamed with untamed fury, and snowstorms blinded the landscape. After the unforgiving Antarctic wilderness claimed one of their own, Mawson and Mertz kept fighting against severe frostbite, gnawing hunger and overwhelming exhaustion. Despite these hardships, under Mawson's steadfast leadership, they persisted for weeks. In this ordeal, Mawson didn't just lead, he became a symbol of unyielding resilience. His expertise in geology, coupled with formidable survival skills, formed the bedrock of their survival. As their circumstances turned increasingly grim, Mawson's indomitable spirit served as a beacon of hope and inspiration for a while. As Mawson and his companion, Xavier Mertz, ventured deeper into the Antarctic wilderness, their situation grew increasingly dire. With their supplies dwindling, they faced a harrowing decision. To survive, they would need to rely on their remaining sled dogs for sustenance. The harsh reality of their survival strategy soon took its toll. When Mawson's remaining comrade, Xavier Mertz, succumbed to insanity and ultimately perished due to the brutal conditions. Mertz's passing dealt a significant blow to Mawson, who now faced the daunting reality of being utterly alone in the vast icy wilderness with safety hundreds of miles away. 
Isolated and battling overwhelming odds, Mawson's struggle for survival became a testament to human endurance. He faced each day with a combination of scientific ingenuity and raw determination, rationing his meagre supplies and using his knowledge of the terrain to navigate. In one harrowing moment, Mawson's life hung in the balance as he narrowly escaped death, falling into a crevasse. Clinging to the edge, he summoned every ounce of his strength to pull himself out, his will to survive stronger than ever. With his physical condition deteriorating, Mawson began the long, treacherous journey back to base camp. Each step was a battle against the elements and his own physical limits. But his resolve never wavered, driven by the thought of returning home and honouring the memory of his fallen comrades. Despite suffering from snow blindness, frostbite and extreme exhaustion, Mawson continued. His journey was marked by moments of despair and loneliness, yet his spirit remained undaunted. He traversed the icy expanse, a lone figure against the vastness of Antarctica. In a moment that brought a glimmer of hope, Mawson stumbled upon a supply depot. The sight of food and shelter was a lifeline. It was here that he found the strength to continue, knowing that each step brought him closer to safety. As Mawson neared the end of his journey, his physical state was critical. Each step was a battle against exhaustion and despair. Mawson's journey back to base camp was a profound display of human endurance and survival against all odds. His story is not just one of overcoming the harshness of nature, but a reminder of the resilience and strength of the human spirit. Douglas Mawson's return to civilization was met with awe and admiration. His harrowing tale of survival in the Antarctic captivated the world. Recognized for his extraordinary contributions to exploration and science, Mawson was later knighted, becoming Sir Douglas Mawson, an attestation to his enduring legacy. Mawson's impact extended far beyond his Antarctic exploits. His scientific discoveries and geological studies contributed immensely to our understanding of the polar regions. His legacy is celebrated in numerous ways, notably with his face adorning the Australian $100 bill, a tribute to a national hero. Sir Douglas Mawson's story is more than a tale of survival. It's a narrative of courage, resilience, and the unyielding human spirit. His journey reminds us of the extraordinary feats that one can achieve in the face of adversity. Mawson's experiences in the Antarctic continue to inspire explorers and scientists. His determination and scientific curiosity set a benchmark for future expeditions. There's no doubt that his legacy lives on, inspiring us to explore, to discover, and to persevere. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the life and legacy of Sir Douglas Mawson, a true pioneer whose story continues to inspire and resonate with us all.